Hello everyone. In this video today, we will learn about loyalty points in Mark Books. We will also see how you can manage points for your customers in Mark Books and how to view loyalty reports. So, let's first understand what are loyalty points. Just like these days, whenever we make online or offline purchase, then we earn points on those purchases. For example, if you shop for 2000 rupees, you may earn 5 points, or if you shop for 5000 rupees, you may earn 8 points. The benefit of this is that if customers have points, they will come back to make purchases, which can help to grow your business. And in loyalty points, the customer is centralized, which means that no matter from which of your branch a customer makes a purchase, the details of their points will be retrieved in every branch. Now, let's come and see the process. To do this, from the dashboard, you will click on settings, then click on the configure button corresponding to the control room. Here you will search loyalty and select yes from loyalty management. Then press the escape key to save the changes. Next, you will come to the CRM and you will see that the loyalty management option has been enabled. Click on it. And now we will set up the loyalty points here. Here from the point apply on. Select whether you want to apply points item wise or on the bill amount. If you select here item wise, then you will select whether the point system applies to all items or selected items. And if you select bill amount, then this field will be disabled because the points will then be calculated based on the total bill amount. For now, we select bill amount, then mention the point redeem rate that which specifies the amount at which customers can redeem points. For example, we've mentioned 10 here, which means customers can redeem points when they accumulate 10 points then is whether the points automatically round off or not. Next is on which method points should be calculated. First, you select fraction here and then mention rupees 500 and mention the one point. This means that if the bill amount is 500 or more, the customer will earn one point. If the bill amount is 499 or less, then no points will be awarded. In other words, points will be calculated based on the bill amount being 500 or higher. The next method is range of amount. Through this, you can specify the criteria that from which amount to which amount will how many points be awarded. For example, we mentioned that if the bill amount is between 100 and 500, then you will earn 5 points. If it falls between 501 and 1000, then you will earn 10 points. And if you want to delete a particular range, then you will click on the delete button corresponding to that record. So, as we select the fraction here, and then we mention a point, let's say rupees 500. And we mention a point 5, which means that if the bill amount is 500, you will earn 5 point. Now, let's see its process in billing. First, let's update it. Then, we generate a sales bill. We will mention the customer's mobile number. After that, we will select the doctor. Next, we will select the item and mention a quantity of 1 and enter. So, you will see that you have earned 5 points. If you change the quantity here, the points will be calculated accordingly. So, the more the bill amount, the more points you will earn. Now, let's see how a customer can redeem points. As we had set up in the loyalty setup that a customer can redeem points when they have 10 points, for example, the customer for whom we just generated a sale bill. Now, the same customer comes back and you generate their sale bill by entering their mobile number. And as soon as you enter the mobile number, you will see that this customer has a total of 15 points. And now, to redeem these points, you will click on redeem points from here. You will see these fields. You will select here whether these points should be redeemed in percentage or in numbers. For example, if you select numbers, then you will enter the redeem points. Now, you can see the invoice value is 150 rupees. Now, as we enter redeem points here, let's say 5. And you will see that, after the points are redeemed, the invoice value here is now 100. And along with that, you can see how many points are left and the points in rupees are also shown. Now, save the bill. So in this way, customers can redeem points. After that, let's take a look at the loyalty report. For this, you will go to reports, to account reports, and select loyalty report. So in this way, the loyalty report will be generated. Here, you can see how many points the customer has earned, how many they have redeemed, and what their balance is. 
You can also see the rate per point and the value. And by pressing the enter key on a particular record, you can also view their further record. So, in this way, you can manage loyalty points in marked books. Thanks for watching.